Six of Pentacles is here. This talks about balance. It talks about giving. This could be a gift. This could be you sharing your wealth or... This could be um, just you being someone that's very equal, very balanced. You always balance things out. Um, you care about people. You take care of people. You're always giving and sharing with people. And um, this energy could be masculine or feminine. It could be past, present, or near future. Um, this could be you going through this, someone that you're attached to, someone that you detached from, different people that are around you, or someone that wants to come towards you. This is just overall energy. Um, you have to take what resonates and just leave what does not. But the Six of Pentacles talks about equal give and take. You're very equal with people. You're always giving to people. Ten of Cups is here. Yeah. And then nine of wands is here. So somebody is nervous because something is something could be balanced out. This could be a group of people that are nervous with the Ten of Cups, you know. It not only talks about family, this could, you know, be a group of people. This also could be a family, you know. They're nervous because something is being balanced out. They did something over and over and over again. Yeah. Queen of Pentacles is here. Yeah, whatever they did, you're in this Queen of Pentacles energy. You're someone that's very stable, very grounded. You're someone that's like a boss. You could have multiple businesses. Um, someone that is, you know, financially stable. You're someone that's very nurturing. Six of Pentacles, equal, loyal, honest. The death card, two of wands and four of swords is here. Something was laid to rest. It's like you've isolated yourself from someone or a situation and laid it to rest. You went through some type of transformation after you isolated yourself from that situation. It can't, it's like you experienced a rebirth. A lot of people are standing at a stalemate. They don't even know which way to go because you haven't transformed. And this could be why, you know, this person or group of people are nervous. Yeah, the world is here. It's like you're in a whole nother cycle. You completed a cycle and you walked into a whole nother cycle. And you're someone that's very self-sufficient. Nine of Pentacles is here. Single, abundant. As you have, it's only ten Pentacles in the deck and you have nine by yourself. So it's like you went through a lot to get to this energy. Yeah, and it's after you isolated yourself from someone and, you know, you were able to transform. You completed a toxic cycle with somebody. Could have been a group of people. It could have been a person. Now a group of people are nervous. They could have did something to try to have you at a stalemate because you separated yourself or isolated yourself for a source from somebody that was, um, this is somebody that was draining your energy. So you needed to recharge your energy for sources here. You laid that situation to rest, ended that cycle out. You completed a toxic cycle and walked into another cycle. Very abundant. Nine of Pentacles is here. Queen of Pentacles. Then you have King of Pentacles on the bottom of the deck. So it's like, it's like once you close that cycle out with that person, it's like you're only manifesting someone that's in your energy. That's it. Whoever this energy is, they were nervous about something or they did something over and over again thinking that they would have you in a never-ending cycle. This person is dealing with some type of abandonment issues. Once you, you know, sink, got, you know, separate, isolated yourself from this person that was single, they were at a stalemate not knowing which way to go. Yeah, they weren't happy. The sun card in the reverse. This person did not want you to be happy because they weren't happy. This is somebody that did not expect to get exposed. They did not want to get exposed for why you isolated yourself from this person. Why you cut this person off. Now this person is sitting back nervous. <laughs> this person and their entire family could be nervous because of whatever this person had to did to try to have you at a stalemate. Yeah, Six of Wands is here. They're nervous because you're having victory and success. 
you're someone that is um successful respected well known you're being held in high honor a lot of people look up to you and this person is sitting back at the nine of wands on a merry-go-round where they wanted you to uh to be after you hadn't isolated yourself from this person yeah that's that's something that you know needed with the death card being here it had to come to an end so you could transform and it's like you went through a transformation these people are standing at a stalemate they're nervous because these are people that could have got behind the scenes and wanted you to go through something over and over and over again yeah now it's like whatever they did you're being seen at the six of wands having victory and success a lot of people hold you in high honor respect you and they look up to you you're being seen for who you are these are people that could not have you being exposed for what they wanted you to be you know seen as and they're in fear some they're nervous about something two of swords is here they're nervous about Something they did to try to blind somebody from the truth. Yeah, Ten of Swords is here. They tried to blind somebody from the truth and they did something to try to betray you so they're nervous. Yeah. Oh, excuse me. Yeah, they lied to somebody, Two of Swords. They came in quick, lied to this person, and they wanted you pent down. Ten of Swords. This person was scared. They, okay, whatever they lied about, they could have been scared. They were in fear. Nine of Wands is here. So they made up something. And it's like they wanted you pent down at the Ten of Swords uh, for harsh, painful endings. Whoever they lied to, these people could have believed it. And they wanted to pin you down, Ten of Swords. This person had done went and lied to these people and betrayed you. They were nervous about something. This person was nervous when you isolated yourself from them. And they, it's like they, they weren't happy or something like that. Two of Pentacles is here. And then the Strength card is here. This person lied and made it seem like you were someone that was struggling. You were someone that was at the Two of Pentacles trying to figure out how are you going to balance this and that out. You were, you know, basically like you were someone that was like, you know, like a setup artist. Like this is someone that could have been like going back and forth trying to plan something out because they're always trying to figure out how they're going to make ends meet. So this person tried to make it seem like you wanted to take something from somebody or something like that. This Two of Pentacles. yeah they could have made it seem like that you were trying to do like this person this person is nervous whatever they said about you was not true they did this because they wanted you to be at a stalemate after you isolate yourself from them now they're in fear this person had to lie to a group of people could have been their family or just could have been a group of people they made it seem like you were penny pinching two of pinnacles is here Yeah. And then the strength card is here. It's like whatever they said, it did not work. You're being seen as someone that this person took through a lot. Or you had to went through a lot. And whatever you went through, you stood up by yourself and dealt with that. You're someone that's very strong. Whatever this person said, if this person tried to make it seem like you were broke or something like that, or you were always trying to do, you know, do something to make ends meet, it did not work. You're in this Queen of Pentacles energy. It's like this person is a Two of Pentacles, and you're in a Queen of Pentacles and Nine of Pentacles. This person is in fear after lying. Nine of Wands. They did this over and over and over again. Thinking that they would have you at a stalemate, two of wands, not knowing which way to go because you're at the nine of pentacles, queen of pentacles, manifesting someone that's just like you, king of pentacles. After completing a cycle out with this person that needed to end, the world card and death is here. This was something that had to end. You needed to recharge your energy. You needed to lay that situation to rest and isolate yourself from that person. 
Yeah, and it's once you once you isolate yourself from that person, you were in this Queen of Pentacles energy, Nine of Pentacles. This person was in this Two of Pentacles, always going back and forth trying to figure out how they're going to do this. I was getting ready to say, how are they going to get high? So this person is someone that could have been, got high a lot. And they were like a penny pincher and they didn't have much. This person wanted different people to think that you were someone. They tried to transfer their energy off onto you. This is sad. Yeah, the lovers is here and six of cups is here. Five of cups and nine of swords. A lot of people... It's like this person was in regret. You exposed something. The lovers and six of cups. And then queen of cups. So it's like you were only good to this person. You poured out love to this person. This person expected you to stay in a relationship with them. They didn't want to let go of the past. So this person figured since you had to isolate yourself from them, they could blind, you know, different people from the truth. Whoever they, whoever they um, went and lied to, these are people that they were scared of. Yeah, they were in regret when you had to expose the truth. Five of Cups is there. You had to expose something about this person and they were in fear. Yeah. This Nine of Swords talks about being in fear being um can't sleep at night constantly having nightmares so whatever they did <laughs> not only is this person being haunted for what they did to you but whatever they did to that part so they did something to somebody and they tried to hide it and it's like they wanted to blind that person from the truth so they came in quick and used you but since you had an isolate yourself and ended the situation i'll let them use you and make it seem like you're someone that's at the Two of Pentacles juggling. And you're a Queen of Pentacles. This person is at the Two of Pentacles trying to figure out how could they make ends meet. How could they balance the situation out. Juggling between thoughts and finance trying to figure this out. I'm so done. This person is that sad. Yeah, Ace of Pentacles is here. Yeah. Nine of Cups and then Eight of Pentacles is here. So it's like somebody wants to work with you. Or somebody have been watching you Nine of Cups as Wish Fulfillment. Yeah, it's like you've been working on yourself, working by yourself, doing you, focusing on whatever businesses or goals. Or Eight of Pentacles is like just working on yourself. You could have got a new career, a new job. You could have opened a new business, something like that. And nine of cups is here. It's like you're happy and content. Whatever this person had done did, they did it out of fear. And it was they spread it some type of gossip and slander and lies on you. And now they're sitting back at the five of cups in regret. It did not add up. It's like this person made it seem like you were two of pentacles and then queen of pentacles is here. If you had to isolate yourself from this person. Yeah, you exposed this person and they wanted, they betrayed somebody and they wanted to blind that person from the truth. So they, not only did they betray that person, but they betrayed you. You could have exposed this to someone. It's something you exposed about this person. Page of Pentacles. And then the chariot is here. Yeah, it was something that you exposed about this person, Page of Pentacles, and then the Chariot. Knight of Swords and Ten of Pentacles. It's like this person is upset. This person is mad because of your abundance. You have, um, you know, as I say, as you're at the nine of pentacles, walking straight into the ten of pentacles, this person is angry. This is you on this ten of pentacles. 
So it's like whatever this person tried to make it seem like you were at the Two of Pentacles, you were at the Nine of Pentacles when you separated from this person and walking straight into this Ten of Pentacles. After you had to move forward from this person, this person is somebody that's very childish. You've moved on from this person and they didn't have anything to offer you. Page of Cups is here. I mean, Page of Pentacles. So it's like you expose why you moved on from this person. And then the musician is here. Seven of Pentacles and then the devil. Yeah. You spoke the truth, Queen of Swords on the bottom of the deck about this person. It's like now they're angry. They're angry because you're sitting in this ten of pentacles. They were they already ran and quick tried to blind, you know, different people from the truth about whatever you spoke about this person. Yeah, this is sad. Yeah, somebody is sitting back at the three of swords heartbroken. King of Wands and Three of Swords. Seven of Pentacles and the Devil. Yeah. Somebody is heartbroken because they could have paid somebody to do something that was toxic. Or they invested in something that was very toxic. Or they invested in... This could be somebody that believed this person. And it's like now they're at the three of swords heartbroken. This person did something to try to trick somebody to um, believe something that was not true. Three of wands. And justice is here. High Priestess in the reverse. So everything came out. Justice is being served. Decisions have been made on that already. Three of Wands is here. Just based off of the decisions that you made to isolate yourself from that person. I don't know who this person is that says the Three of Swords heartbroken. But they're going through some type of depression or heartache. High priest is in the reverse. They could have been investing with this person or they paid different people or paid somebody to do something. Yeah, this is sad. Ad. Based off of whatever this person did or whatever this person said and they're at the Five of Cups in regret. Whoever the person is that lied on you to try to make it seem like you were someone that was at the Two of Pentacles, they're in regret. They're at the Five of Cups. They got exposed. Not only did you speak the truth about this person, expose this person, they exposed their self. Ten of Wands is here. And it's like they're at this Ten of Wands. They went from the Nine of Wands, doing something over and over again in fear. Now they're being weighed down. Because the truth is coming out. Ten of Wands and Ace of Swords. They feel burdened because they the truth had been exposed. Something was no longer hidden. Whatever they tried to hide, it got exposed. That's why justice is in the upright. Something injustice happened. And somebody made a decision to do this. Like literally based off of something that they were told. But they were at the Two of Swords blinded from the truth. Now, as they were at the Two of Swords blinded from the truth, they got it. You know, something came out. They gained truth and clarity. Now they're at the Three of Swords heartbroken. Whoever this King of Wands is, they're stressed out and depressed. 
Temperance is here and Five of Wands is here. Yeah, they're stressed out and depressed about whatever conflict. This person could have been at the Five of Wands. Because they were at the Two of Swords blinded from the truth. And it's like they want to balance the situation out. They want to balance out whatever conflict or something that happened. This person's at the Three of Swords literally heartbroken. They could have believed that it's they were blind at the two of from the truth. And it's like they had an invested to, into doing something that was toxic. Yeah. With this person or because of this person that blinded them at the two of swords from the truth. They got betrayed. Eight of Cups is here. Yeah, they stopped communicating with that person. They, they don't even communicate with that person. They've walked away from that person and they, they have not looked back. Four of Cups is here. Yeah, they've been rejecting this person. So this person could be trying to reach out to them, contact them, and they're not even uh, talking to this person. They're sitting back unhappy about whatever they did. And they're rejecting this person. After they ended up getting lied to. Yeah, King of Swords. If they cut this person off, King of Swords. This is the same person that you had them cut off. And they're sitting back at the Nine of Wands. This is the person you isolated yourself from. Whoever this person is is somebody that they got behind the scenes and they had to lie to. They blinded this person from the truth. This person could have did something, wanted to betray you. Ten of Swords with that person. And it's like after they found out the truth, they found out this person had to lie to them. Two of Swords is here. Yeah, and it's like now they're rejecting this person's calls, messages, what, different stuff like that. Eight of Cups is here. This person walked away from a confused mindset. The Emperor is here. And then King of Cups. This is some serious. And then Tower. <laughs> Yeah, this person is, yeah, this is sad. Yeah. Tower, Seven of Swords, and Four of Pentacles. So it's like they realized that this person was only trying to hold on to you with this Four of Pentacles to try to control you or have some type of leverage over you. And they were being sneaky and deceptive behind the scenes. They didn't know a lot of stuff would come out of this tower. And whatever they were doing sneaky in a deceptive way, it would cause a tower moment for them. And they would get exposed. This is something that they cannot come back from. This person had to create a lot of stuff that they cannot come back from trying to hold on to you. Four of Pentacles is here. Now, this was a Knight of Wands energy. This was somebody that was at the Knight of Wands. This was somebody that was, um, they were a Knight of Wands energy. Somebody that would do stuff without thinking. Somebody that, um, was like a lustful energy. This is someone that did not, you know, they, they were the type of person that would just use you for whatever they can, whenever they can. Yeah, and then the Empress is here. The Will of Fortune is here. Whatever this person did, it was destined to take place. You're in this Empress energy or this Emperor energy. Take it where it resonates. And um, this was destined to happen because you have a will of fortune. You have a destiny. You have a um, divine counterpart. And that person was not it. This was destined to happen so this person could get caught up. Eight of Swords is here. This person owe a lot of debts. This person done did, they did a lot of stuff that they cannot come back from. And they ended up getting caught. As they were at the Seven of Swords creating a tower moment for their self. Being sneaky, thinking that they were going to get away with, you know, whatever they were doing to blind different people from the truth. They thought they were smarter than you. This person ended up getting caught. Eight of Swords is here. And it's like now they cannot move. Now they're at the, you know, blinded from the truth. They're binding and blinded at the Eight of Swords. 
They got caught. Yeah. This person just ran in quick. They're a knight of wands energy. Doing stuff without thinking and thought that they were going to get away with it. They didn't even think towards what, you know, what the outcome would be. This is someone that's a knight of wands energy. They didn't think that it would be something that they would get caught up in and they wouldn't be able to come back from. They didn't think that different people would find out the truth that they hadn't lied to. They didn't think that, um, yeah, they didn't think that you would be able to, um, end up manifesting what's destined for you. Yeah, or be abundant. They thought they had to pinch you down at the Ten of Swords. And you will be blinded from the truth and other people that they lied to will be blinded from the truth. Two of Swords. And now this person is hiding out. The hermit is here. This person was trying to have you in hermit mode. Because you were attracting a lot of attention. Once you isolate yourself from that person and cut that person off and ended that situation, you were attracting a lot of attention. Queen of Wands. This person wanted you to be isolated. The hermit is here. So they figured that they would go in quick. A lot of different people to try to um, help them betray you. And they will be blinded from the truth. They ended up getting exposed. Truth and clarity is here. And it's like whatever was exposed, it caused a tower moment. And this is something that that person cannot come back from. They created towers for their self. Yeah, and I, I just keep hearing that they can't come back from that. Yeah, the star card is here. And then two of cups is here. Yeah, whoever you're getting ready to partner up with or work with. Yeah, it's like you and this person needed to heal. You could have helped that person heal, the person that you're getting ready to partner up with or work with. Two of Cups. And this person ended up getting caught for whatever they did. And it's like they can't come back from it. They're stuck. Bonnie, bonnie inside up for every debt that they owe. 